What's going on, guys? Back here for some more football. So, before I get started, right? Preseason hate week versus the Tennessee Titans. Preseason game number one this Thursday. So, yes, you read the title correctly. Preseason hate week. And you're probably asking me, Eagle Speed, you're a four or five year TTC video maker. You should know better to not make preseason eight week videos. Well, let me explain to you why I'm making preseason hate weeks this year. When the Philadelphia Eagles won Super Bowl 52, I took a year off from video making. I need to get warmed up, per se. So, these four weeks is a four week trash talking period where I can get warmed up, right? The fire starter to the fire that I'm bringing for the regular season this year, all right? Don't you think I didn't forget about Washington week one? Okay, Washington week one is on my mind, as you can see. That's one of the bigger hate weeks of the year, week one. Not only since it's the start of the football season, but division rival as well. Now, the Tennessee Titans. They have the worst quarterback in the AFC South. Marcus Mariota is not better than Andrew Luck. He's not better than Deshaun Watson. And he is not better than the Super Bowl 52 MVP Nick Foles. Marcus Mariota is trash, okay? He's, he has the most underrated defense in the league, and I admit that. I admit that to Titans fans. I actually made a video earlier explaining why the Titans do. Okay, so the Titans had the most underrated defense in the league. Marcus Mariota has one of the better offensive tackle tandems in the NFL with Jake, with uh, not Jake, but Jack Conklin and Taylor Luan. He has a bruising running back that made the NFL top 100 this year, Derrick Henry. He has one of the more underrated athletic tight ends in Delaney Walker. He has a number one receiver in Corey Davis. So why couldn't he make the playoffs last year? The Tennessee Titans swept the NFC East and they beat the Patriots and still managed to miss the playoffs. How does that happen? You know why? Because you can't beat Andrew Luck and the Colts. And that's why I have the Colts as the Super Bowl team this year and the Colts winning the AFC South this year. Not the Titans. You guys have the defense. You have the defense which isn't unshreddable. Because obviously the Colts have shown time and time again that you can pick apart the Titans. But let's get to your other parts of your team. So your quarterback is a liability. Marcus Mariota, great on the run. Great with the option game. What else? Great at scrambling. What else? What else does he bring to the table for you? You see, the Tennessee Titans, they're not only losing this game because they, they don't have a better starting roster than us, but our depth, okay? Depth is the key to winning preseason games. Stefan Wisniewski, our backup guard, would start for you right now. Our receiver depth is so much better. Your corners are the weakness of your defense. Malcolm Butler... The Super Bowl 52 bench target? Come on now. He can't cover Deshaun Jackson and now Sean Jeffrey. You're going to get torched. Oh yeah, congratulations. You picked up Ryan Tannehill as your backup. Ryan Tannehill was so low valued that the Dolphins didn't even want to keep him around as a backup. And they valued getting Josh Rosen and Ryan Fitzpatrick over Ryan Tannehill. So what does that tell you about Ryan Tannehill? You don't have a quarterback with him either. You see, the problem with the Tennessee Titans is the quarterback position. Ever since they lost by a yard to the 99 Rams, it's been, you know, it's been a joke over there down in Tennessee. No one cares about Tennessee. The Tennessee Titans are going to get rocked. This is a revenge game. Right? For the 4th and 15 
BS that they beat us on last year, we're going to pick them apart. We're coming down. It don't matter preseason or not. This goes back to my coaching days. You give me a stadium, you give me a time, we'll be there and we'll show up to kick your ass. That's what we're going to do. Nate Sudfeld is our quarterback number two in this game. He's already been in the system with us for three years, learning behind Wentz and Nick Foles. Nate Sudfeld, great system player to have on your team. Malik Jackson from Jacksonville is familiar with your offensive line and offense. Jonathan Cyprian, who we picked up from you guys, is going to help us out in this game in the third quarter. You guys have little to no chance. Eagles are winning this preseason game. Bet money on it. All right. Anyways, this is Speed, and I'm out.